Hey guys, welcome to this video. In today's is a vid, we're gonna be talking about here. Me a lot moisturized. Before I get started, I wanted to say, hey, I'm sorry for not posting in the past like week or so. Um, and also for the fact of my schedule, my posting schedule is like super, super off. I didn't even post at the beginning of this week. But next week is going to be normal. I am going to Cincinnati, so I'm pre-recording videos for the next week. So everything should be posted on Tuesdays and Thursdays like I like. Unlike today where it's just a big mess. I've had to deal with finals for the past two weeks and if you're like, what do you mean? Finals aren't until like May. Well, I go to DePaul, okay? And if you haven't heard before in like a majillion other videos that I've said, we're on a trimester system where we have three semesters and my second semester just ended today. I just turned in my last paper and I'm so happy. But now I'm going to be trying to record any time that I have um, so that I always have videos out for you guys. Try not to be lazy. I know it's so hard. It's so hard. Let's get on with the video talking about the Miralat moisturizers. So about a month ago on February 12th, I emailed them saying, hey, I'm a small YouTuber and I'm looking out to find some good skincare products and I'd love to talk about them on my channel, on my Instagram, and all this stuff. Am I talking really fast? I am talking really fast. I was expecting them to be like, hey, maybe if you get like more of a following, like you have a small following, so maybe like a year out seemed like an amazing product. And even if they said no, I was going to buy their product and try it out anyways, but they did send me a box with two moisturizers and a cute little t-shirt. It says hashtag natural beauty. Purple is not my favorite color, but this shade of purple is just amazing. Onto the actual product. There's two products that they sent me, which was the Miralat Moisturizer and the Miralat Radiant Night Cream. I did ask them, like, hey, was there something specific that you wanted me to tell my viewers that so then they go to your website, like, they know what kind of products they're purchasing. They wanted to say, overall, about all their products, is they are cruelty-free, they're not tested on animals at all, their products are made within the US and they're all paraben free. A lot of their products do focus on like anti-wrinkle and like anti-aging, but I mean, even for someone like me, I mean, starting young, you know. So let's go on with the Mirlot moisturizer. So they also gave me this little piece of paper in it that tells me about each moisturizer. The Mirlot moisturizer absorbs quickly and works as a perfect primer before applying makeup or facing the day. Meaning that you can put this under makeup as a primer to help set your makeup into your skin without it clogging your pores. Ultra Gentle Lightweight Formula does so much more than just leave the skin feeling silky smooth. This moisturizer works to fight against the particles that contribute to the signs of premature aging. Zinc Oxide, it's designed for daily use and it can be used as a primer before applying on makeup, not oily, absorbs quickly. Basically, they repair themselves at the end. Just to emphasize that it can be used as a primer. Okay, as a primer, this moisturizer, natural grape seed skincare. Let's get on with the actual review of this product. One of the things I wanted to focus on, since I don't have like a lot of wrinkles to test this on, I wanted to test the fragrance free, non oily, absorbs quickly, and the primer aspect of the moisturizer. Free was the easiest one to test. Literally, I put it on my face, and as soon as it absorbed into my skin, the fragrance was gone. If you smell it, there's like a grapey, not like a candy grape, like a natural, eh, got on with it. Like a natural smelling, just a light. It's just like a super light smell. It's not super intense. It's not like your Bath and Body Works lotion. So while I was testing the fragrance free, I was testing the absorbs quickly part of it. And the fact that it absorbs so quickly, it surprised me. It absorbs so nicely. It absorbs so quickly and it didn't leave it like tacky or anything. It was just like a nice, like my skin feels like a healthy skin. I then put on my makeup and it looked great. So today I'm using the like day moisturizer, I guess you could call it, because it says on here it is um, designed for daily use and can be used as a primer for applying makeup. So I'm seeing if that helps my makeup stay longer and hopefully maybe help reduce like oiliness because my skin does get oily. So we'll see if it'll help that plus keeping like the, because I have a combination skin. So I have like oily parts of my face and then places that get really dry throughout the day. So let's see if this helps me. Now 
I'm going to apply my makeup and see how well it looks on just as is. And then we'll check in tonight after my class and see how well it looks done. I will say that it's like, it doesn't seem as like my makeup as creamy as it usually is when I put on makeup. It still like feels like it needs to dry. It's like my makeup is like set and I didn't even put any setting powder on. It's just like, I'm actually really enjoying this. It looks real nice. Well, I would like, you can't see it on camera. It's mostly like, cause I go real close, like this close to a mirror to see, but it's not as like, cause usually if I go like this at the end of the day, makeup will start coming off on my finger. And again, I don't like using setting powders or sprays cause it's just, I just like putting makeup on, especially like a day like this where I was going to one class. Like, I just want to get up and go. The next one to go over is the Moonlight Radiant Night Cream. Combine the power of natural grapeseed antioxidants with Argoline and Matrix So 3000 to fight free radicals, boost skin tone, and increase skin thickness. The formula helps keep in moisturizer overnight and leaving the skin feeling firm and healthy. And this one, out of the two of them, probably would be my favorite because I like the fact what it did to my skin throughout the night. I like overnight moisturizers because my skin, I have combination skin, so I have an oily T-zone and chin with super dry patches, like, my cheeks are usually normal unless like I have a really rare day, but like around the mouth area, like here and around my nose, I have dry patches. So finding a moisturizer that moisturizes my skin without leaving it oily, like is great. <laughs> For also on the package itself, it says it promotes collagen formation and helps repair deep lines and wrinkles. And again, I do not have wrinkles to test out that part of the product but if you would like to go ahead it was really surprising because I put it on after my skincare routine and I used it as the moisturizer and at, when I woke up in the morning it was just like a really good feeling it wasn't uh, too dry it wasn't super oily moisturized it was like just dewy where it just felt like my skin was healthy and it, my skin looked healthy like the, that was the whole thing like my skin looked and felt healthy and moisturized and ready to take on the day without having to actually put on more moisturizer but since I do wash my face in the morning of course I'm gonna to want to put a moisturizer on afterwards which this one comes into play meaning just a regular moisturizer Jesus it rolled all the way over there I have so much to say about both of the products and I don't want to bore you so if you want to know more about each products please go down in the description below I'll leave all the information that I can possibly with links and everything. If you have any other questions and the links don't help, please feel free to put them in the comments below. I'd love to help you guys out in answering some questions or even some of you guys can answer some of the questions that people have. I also have a lot of skincare products that I use to help fight acne on my skin. So if you guys want to hear about those, please let me know down in the comments below. I'd love to share them with you guys and I do have a lot, like I have a crate full not stuff that I use every single day, but just things that I like to use within like a month. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please hit that like button down below and don't forget to subscribe. I make videos twice a week. Don't forget to share on all the social media and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace. I also wanted to say thank you to Muralot for sending me these products. You didn't have to and I'm just so grateful for them. So thank you again, Muralot, for the products. And I will say, honestly, this whole review was honest. Even if they didn't give me the products, I would have bought them myself and tested them out. But just it just so happens that the fact that they sent them to me and asked me to record a video and talk about them, that here you are listening to me. So thank you, Muralot. And again, I will see you guys in the next video.